Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, make sure to hit the subscribe button because I love for you to ride with me. My channel is growing slowly but surely. So, in today's video, I want to show you how I make my keto-friendly breakfast burritos. We're going to put steak, egg, and cheese in a low-carb burrito, but the catch is I make it on the truck in my Road Pro accessories. So, yeah, let's get started. All right, so I have my portable oven that I'm going to go ahead and plug in. And we will get the steak ready because I think that'll take the longest because it was in the freezer. So, and that looks delicious. Oh, you're going to plug it in there for me. Okay, thank you, Joshua. Okay, I already lined my oven with the tin foil. And... Let's see what we have in here. Sorry, I'm doing this one-handed. Get out of there. Thank you. Okay, okay. So it's like one slab. All right, let me put y'all down. All right, so I just put the steak in the tin foil in the Road Pro portable oven or portable stove, whatever you want to call it. And we're going to let this cook for a little while, just like so. And while that's cooking, I'm going to go ahead and set up my other one and get the egg started. Where is my box? Oh, let me see my steak unbox. I'm going to put the steak back in the freezer. All right, so I'm going to put my steak back in the freezer and there goes my butter. Oh, how I hate cooking on the truck. So inconvenient. Man, what are we going to do? No, it's not too bad just I don't have much space to work with here at this big old table that I just got from Walmart so I could look a little more professional do you want sausage I can do that with the eggs no okay so just the That's steak fine. egg and cheese burrito breakfast burrito okay all right let's go ahead and plug in the pan and get the butter out. I'm only going to use about a tablespoon of butter. And I cannot do this one handed. I actually grew another hand. Look. Okay. I'm going to let you take over. Are you sure? Even though I don't like the way that you record me. It's either too far up or too far back, and I did that so wrong. Okay. See, I'm having to use my bed. Jesus. What am I going to do with you, Josh? What are you going to do with me? Yeah. Well, you've kept me around this long, so. You better keep you around a little bit longer. I got too much invested now, don't I? Yep. So I'm going to use about a tablespoon, and I don't like, meh, that'll work. Okay. I'm a professional here. Don't judge. Keep your opinions to yourself, please. All right. Uh, oh, look at that. Look at that. You see that? It's already starting to melt. I'm so happy. Alright, so but, we're going to use about... But don't worry, I got you in the pan, in the camera. Ooh, okay. Alright, so I have six eggs here. I'm just going to... Crack. Ew, this is so gross. Three. Three should be enough for two of our we'll just share but I don't like sharing. well it's got to be an even number so we'll just do four <laughs> but I don't like sharing well guess what 
<laughs> Tough luck. To Tough luck. Get over that. You're married. <laughs> and what's yours is mine, and what's mine is mine. So, I own you. No, I'm only kidding. Okay, so we got this um, in the pan, the eggs in the pan. And this video is all over the place. I am sorry. I don't even know why y'all watch me. But this is what y'all want. So I'm going to give it to you hard. <laughs> Josh is like behind the camera. He's like grinning from ear to ear. Like I wish you would give it to me hard. <laughs> okay. I better shut up before I embarrass myself I guess right. Well, okay, so we're gonna just let that quit rambling and we're gonna check on this. Ooh, we, I thought, I actually believe that the, I'm gonna just use the same knife that, knife that I'm using my eggs. Y'all don't like it, get over it, it's fine. Okay. And this was two slabs. I'm calling them slabs because they look like slabs. But this was two servings, and there's hardly anything here. I've never used the steak, um, steak before, so I really don't know how it's going to turn out. But should I season it, Josh? Yeah, I think I'm going to season it. Yeah, put some it. of that uh, garlic stuff there, there on go. it. Just a little bit. Put some in the eggs. I don't too. measure my seasonings. I guess on the keto diet you should. And I have butter on my. Oh well, tastes pretty good to me. Okay, so like I said, I don't measure the seasoning just because there's no carbs in seasoning. Well, the seasoning I use. So it's a quarter teaspoon and. There's no calories. There, there's basically nothing other than Himalayan salt, garlic, onion, sea salt, black pepper, red bell pepper. Ooh, I didn't know there was red bell pepper. Lemon peel, parsley, and garlic oil. So, that actually tastes good all by itself. All right, let me close this up. Get a nice view of this while it's cooking. Yeah, buddy, it's looking good. I hate the lighting in this truck. Next time we come out, we're some, we're due home next week. That thing rattles. It's broken. But we're due home next week. So I'm going to bring my lamp that's USB and it's LED on the truck with me. So the lighting will be a little bit better when I film videos when I come back out. So yeah. Yeah. This is going to take a while. I should have started this first. But when this starts to form into scrambled eggs, I'll get back with y'all. All right, so let's go ahead and check on the steak. Yeah, buddy. Woo wee. It looks done. Let's see if I can get a better. I hate the lighting. Yeah looks done so I'm gonna get a paper plate put the steak on a paper plate until we actually use it and this eggs are taking forever to cook not really I mean they are cooking it's just there's four eggs in this pan and I'm scrambling them so yeah okay just a little bit longer on the eggs so I'm just going to use that piece of plastic and let me go ahead and get the steak onto a plate. That was a circus act trying to move the table and making sure that the eggs don't spill all over me and trying to get my tortillas and my shredded cheese out. So yeah. All right. And then on top of that, I forgot to put the eggs and my butter back in the fridge. So they're just gonna have to stay on the bed. I don't care. Oh well. All right, guys. Can you tell?
tell I'm stressed out. Try staying on the truck for two weeks at a time with him. Now, it's not too bad. I actually Jeez. enjoy it. Are you I sure? A, I get a break away from the kids. We're just going to stick these down in there. Let them toast a little bit. I don't care if they're... Oh, well. We'll just do it that way. Let them toast just a little because they're kind of like... I wouldn't say they're soggy, but they have been in the fridge. And actually, Josh, we don't even have to Put them refrigerate the these because you buy them off the shelf. Nope, nope. For freshness, refri refrigerate after opening. Everything's that way, I guess, right? Besides a loaf of bread. All right. And then <laughs> this is basically almost done. Hey, I could have made an omelet, Josh. Ooh, that reminds me. Egg is splatting everywhere. That reminds me of that omelet that I made on the truck. Remember that? Yeah. I'll link that video down in the description below. He made an omelet in our microwave. Um, what about eight months ago? year ago? I don't know. I wish I had a spatula. It would be so much easier. But I don't, so it is what it is. At least okay. we got paper plates. I'm just gonna put some cheese <laughs> up on. Okay, open. Thank you. some cheese up on this joker just like that okay that should be enough and this is basically done guys let this cheese melt and then I'll separate it put the steak on top and I'll get back with you all right guys so the cheese has melted and literally that took like what two minutes if that it excuse you <laughs> mm, but you taste so good okay so that looks so freaking delicious all right i'm gonna go ahead and well i was gonna unplug it but i think i'm gonna do a tortilla in here and a tortilla in here or a burrito burrito in here and a burrito in here because they don't like to fit together in here so we'll see yeah a lot nicer so much better you know what you just hang out there and say too much cheese is better than not enough cheese. Ugh. Ugh. Got a hair in my mouth. Where did that come from? My shed. Just like a husky puppy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Let's get the steak. <laughs> Just like a husky puppy. Okay. Yes, and it's very interesting with her on the truck as well. Yeah? Yeah. You just gotta deal with it. Oh, you know you'd be eating all that fast food if I wasn't on the truck, Josh. You'd be, you'd be, be uh, as big as a whale. I would say, I wouldn't would say a whale, I would say... An elephant? An elephant, rhino. A rhino. 
thought you were going to say hippopotamus, then I could have sang the Christmas song. <laughs> okay. You know what? I'm basically doing this with my hands. It's okay. I hope you washed your hands after using the potty. Well, that's something I'm never, Revealing. never going to tell you. <laughs> that tastes pretty darn good, if you ask me. Okay, so now what we're going to do, you can zoom in a little bit so they can see what I'm doing. Okay, I'm going to take one end of this and just do that. Then take one side, fold it over, take the other side, fold it over, just like this. So it makes kind of like a little burrito. Take this one out and you can see that it took its shape and then I'm going to just flip this, well I'll flip it over like that, that's fine. So then it'll take that shape and stay that way. So it won't take long for that one. And like I said, there's really not enough space to put two in there. so. Either if you want to, you're going to have to do them one and then wait until that's done and then do a second one. Or if you have, I'm running out of space here. If you have, you better stay. Don't you fall. Okay. Stick, stick up there. Put that up underneath there. And put egg. Holy crap. Maybe I That's a lot didn't of divide it evenly, but you know what? It's fine. I'm going to take a piece of it. Ooh. Pretty darn good. If you ask me myself, they ask me. It's good. Okay. I just had a blonde moment. I was going to say, where the heck is my tortilla? <laughs> okay. I'm crazy. Oh, there's my steak. <laughs> this is me on an everyday basis. I'm just saying. That's so easy. Okay. We're just going to throw it. Like this. Get it in there. And then just stick it on there like that. I definitely did not divide that evenly. Oh well. Okay. So. Look at my big mess. It's not too bad. Considering if you tried to make this at home, you'd probably have a bigger mess. I don't know what that, uh, you know, why that is. Like, Especially with a natty patty around. Yeah, my daughter, my three-year-old, <laughs> I've always, like, in the kitchen at home, I have ten pots and pans out, and <laughs> um, all my utensils are dirty when I get through. Uh, plates, and I have Bowls. a huge mess. That I have to clean up. But on the truck, it's not, I mean, it's not, I complain about it, but it's not a very big mess. Like, this goes in the fridge, that goes in the fridge, that goes in the fridge, that goes in the fridge. The seasoning goes back in the drawer here. And then this goes up here, right here. Thing. Yep. And basically, this goes back in there like that. And if that was any taller, I would have had knocked that all over the place. And then Josh would have been out of a burrito. Then it would have been a bigger mess. Big, big mess. That would have been some scrambled eggs. Okay, so basically, ah. I'm done. Let's check on my burrito or Josh's burrito, whoever wants it. Let's flip it over. The side's getting pretty toasted, as you can tell. Oops. Yes, it is toasted. I didn't have the angle there right. That was my fault. Leave it to Josh. Okay. Okay. 
So, <laughs> basically, it's done. The side, ooh, this one's toasting a lot quicker than that one. Ready? One, two, three. Yeah, buddy. Might not look the prettiest, but this stuff's going to taste good. You hear me? Okay, so we've just taken the burritos out of the oven that I had sitting there and out of my pan that is still hot. Note to self, do not touch. <laughs> it will burn you. Okay, so yeah, let's see how it tastes. delicious and if I had some excuse me if I had some hot sauce it'd be even better all right so this is uh, five grams of net carbs per tortilla okay so you can find these basically at any grocery store. I uh, purchased these at Walmart. And um, I know Keto Police, they're going to come at me. Oh my God, it's, it's still bread. It's still a tortilla. Still flour, wheat, whatever. <laughs> Get over it. It's okay. I'm still losing weight. I'm fine. So, yeah. Uh, five grams net carbs. And if I didn't have at least one tortilla in my life, it'd be very, very sad. Because it wouldn't be. I don't a, even want to think about it. It wouldn't be a. Because I can't even have Taco Bell. If that's okay, I got low carb tortillas. All right, guys. Thank you for watching my video. And if you want to see more videos like that, just hit the subscribe button. And I do not have an upload schedule so turn on your post notifications so you won't miss my next video see you in my next one bye that's what it looks like on the inside you can see that cheese and the egg and the steak it is really good